Hi everyone, <laughs> my name is Virginia and I would like to reintroduce myself to you. I haven't made very many long form videos and so I looked at my very first video that I populated on YouTube and I'm like, eh. I did a whole lot of rambling, but you really didn't know who I was. I live in Grand Rapids, Michigan, which is the second largest city in Michigan. I like Grand Rapids because it's a small community. Even though it's a large city, it's like everybody pretty much knows everyone here. And although we're growing fast, it's still a very close-knit close -knit Christian community. And so I've lived here the majority of my life. I moved away once when I was 20. I lived in Minneapolis for a very small period of time. So I am the mother of two adult children and I have six grandchildren ranging from one month old to 23. So um, trying to find out and figure out my niche, I had to really think about it. And I'm a learner by trait. I've always learned new things. Um, some people might consider me a risk taker, but really during the pandemic, I really, to keep my sanity, start doing new things um, that I still do today. Like I consistently um, work out uh, three to four times a week, um, at least eight to 15 minutes. I listened to YouTube videos. I discovered YouTube during the pandemic. I eliminated the news. I watch very little news. I watch nothing negative after nine o'clock at night. Um, so that caused me to have a better life, helped me sleep better at night. It helped me eliminate anxiety from the ongoing news press during the pandemic. Um, I learned how to sing better. I took voice lessons during the pandemic. So I've always been a learner, but it never dawned on me that that is really my thing is learning new things. Some things I fail at, um, in some of my YouTube shorts, you see where I built a fireplace that I had never done before. And that really motivated, motivated me to have a can do spirit. So um, I had never even had a power tool in my hand. So I find um, doing some DIYs now as therapeutic. So I'm, I really wanted to speak to women over 50 um, who have always been defined by being a mother, a grandmother, a wife, a girlfriend, um, just to find your thing. And if I can just help somebody know that you can do anything. I'm not a superstar. I'm just an average person. Um, I have a college degree in management and leadership. I'm in a mid-level position as a strategic sourcing analyst for my company. But like I said, I've always learned. Um, I read a lot of books. I love audio books. Um, I've had successes and I've had failures. So my channel will show you those things. I've become a minimalist in a lot of ways as I've gotten older. So my channel will focus on lifestyles, new challenges, uh, successes, failures, therapy, um, DIYs. So it's more streamlined, but everything is to encourage women to know that we can do whatever we want and we set our minds to. And also how fear has impacted me and slowed me down along the way, but how I have pushed through. So I hope that you learn from my channel and um, that we can help each other grow because that's the most important thing. And being a leader and being an influence, influencer, it's not about me. It's about helping solve issues, helping people see that there is uh, hope at the end of the day. Um, my faith is very important to me. Um, so I know that whatever I put my hands on, I can't do anything without God. And that is really my foundation to everything that I try new um, is that God is the center of everything. So I just want you all to know that my faith is important to me. Um, it's a non-judgmental space, 
but that is my my thing is my faith. So if my faith is pushing me through to uh, continue to be a content creator. On TikTok, I'm under Inspired Eyes 64. Um, Facebook, I'm under my name, uh, Virginia. But um, I'll link all that information in. So I hope you follow me. I hope you like and subscribe my channel. I hope that you share things that as a single person, as a single mom, that you wanted to try and have it. Um, so I have a list of things that I still want to try before I turn 60 at the end of 2024. Um, but like I said, I just hope we grow and learn together. Um, you will also see some of the things I've done in my house the last six months um, that have all been new um, that I that I tried um, and that how it made me feel when I was done. So um, let's see what else I wanted to say that. Um, oh, I love to travel. So if you look at some of my YouTube shorts, you'll see where I've traveled. I plan on taking a big trip before I turn 60. So I'll get a chance to share that with you. Um, a place I've always wanted to go overseas. I always wanted to go to Italy or Europe. Um, and so I want to share those things with you. Um, I don't know which location I'm going to choose yet, but that's towards the end of the, the of the year. But I, I'm in the planning stages, so I will share that with my followers on YouTube. Let me see what else. Um, the importance of self-care. Um, I do go to therapy, and so um, you'll see some of my therapy sessions. Um and how it made me feel afterwards, what I discovered during that, and some of my business ideas that I have been wanting to do that I am pushing myself, I mean, really pushing myself through uh, because I have always wanted to start a business. And so it will all um, evolve around um, becoming the best version of yourself. So I'm excited. So thank you all for taking time to watch my channel. Um, I look forward to your support. I look forward to your ideas and your comments. Uh, and, and again, um, please like, share, and subscribe. So um, I wish you all a good day and thank you very much.